Now, I'm not sure if you're aware of this problem. On an Eiffel Williams, the thread goes on the jockey wheel and uh, you can't knock the jockey wheel up. And that means you'd have to replace the whole of this. So I'm going to attempt to repair this by drilling this hole out and welding in, which is hard to do because it's good cast iron, welding in a um, bolt. Um, um, a nut so I can, so I can bolt the uh, key in into it. So I'm going to drill a hole out with this big drill here and um, that's about just slightly smaller than this this nut. Slightly smaller than this nut. So I'll drill this out, get this in and see if I can weld it in. So I've drilled the hole out, and now I'm going to try and shape the hole to the shape of the nut. So when it's in, I'm using this tool here. Where are we? This tool here, which cuts into the cuts into the side. So that the bolt eventually sits in there and won't turn. Anyway, see how we go. Gosh, it's hot here. Oh, that is almost the shape of the nut. And I'm gonna to attempt to bash that in, heat it up and bash it in. Although, I don't think you need much heat in the south of France at 40 degrees. But anyway, just will tap in with a little knock. I, think I, I can't do both, so. This is how it goes. It's in flush. Uh, I need to put a, a couple of welds in just to block so it doesn't, doesn't turn and doesn't come out. I know I can't weld steel to cast iron, but if I can stop it from coming out and stop it moving, you have ever drill down and um, sort of what they call knitting, knit it with some steel rods. Anyway, I'll show you when I've finished. So I've welded two, I've drilled two holes to, to put um, down straight through down through the bolt to that will stop the bolt from pulling out as I tighten up the uh, key and also stop it from spinning although I've made the shape of the bolt anyway, well, then I'm going to weld these two rods into the bolt and try and put some welding I can't weld uh, cast iron and steel but I can weld I'd make it was called knitting anyway I'll show you what happens okay now I'm going to weld these in uh, just show you what I'm going to do. Well, it's not the most attractive of welds, but um, it's done the trick. Jockey wheel's in, and uh, the bolt's not pulling out. And I think that's uh, it works. <laughs> it saves me a few hundred quid replacing all this. So, anyway, hope to see how you go. Cheers.